Elder Scrolls V Skyrim Legendary Difficulty Playthrough. So here we are with the liberation of Skyrim quests. So that means we're going to head on over to Ulfric, talk to him, and see what other quests we have to do. I don't actually know how long exactly that this quest line is. I think it's 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 got at least four, maybe four or five more. I don't know though, I don't remember. Because liberation kind of sounds like we're getting near the end. But I'm pretty sure we have to take over like 10,000 forts before that can happen. And the forts are going to be pretty much exactly the same. It'll just be kind of be one-handed training for me because uh, it's like you show up there, you have to kill 20 people, and then you're done. Get a lot of NPC help. It's pretty fun. Extremely repetitive, but pretty fun. And it'd be kind of... I mean, that'd, that'd be the kind of quest I could see them doing in an MMO, just not Elder Scrolls because Online like because that doesn't count like as an it. Elder Scrolls game. We've driven the Imperials out of Whiterun. This is good. Very good. We now control the center. It's a powerful position, one I aim to keep. We'll call you Ice Veins now, for the thick blood of our land has seeped into your heart. Here, take this. It's an Imperial officer's sword, a fitting weapon to use against our enemy. I suspect you'll be of greater use to us with greater freedom. So you're free to engage the Imperials as you see fit. But I also want you to find our hidden camp in Valkyrie. Galmar will have special tasks for you, and will need you when we liberate the capital. You'll be doing whatever Galmar tells you to do, and causing as much mayhem as possible for the Empire and any Jarl who supports them. For Skyrim! Hmm. Okay then, I guess we're gonna head on over to Valkyrie. Falkreath hold, so that is absolutely nowhere near Falkreath. I mean, what? <laughs> Alright, then let's go on over to Helgen. So, the way that this will work, I'm either going to switch on over to my werewolf form if there are people there, uh, if there aren't teammates there, or if there are teammates, and then, ah, oh, this is the beginning of the game. It's pretty cool. I kind of wish there was a way to rebuild that. There's mods for that, of course. Anyway, if there are no teammates there, then I'm just going to switch it over to my werewolf form and probably destroy them. So I guess we'll have to go this way. We should give this horse some use. And I also realized I didn't empty my inventory. I will do that at the end of this video, hopefully. Fully. Okay. So this kind of seems like it's just a regular old camp, but it may not be. And it looks like this is not the correct way, but I can just roll on up the hill. Pretty sure that's the wrong way to be rolling. Nope, okay, looks like I can't go this way. Can I? Ah, uh, this, this is so much better in Oblivion when you're trying to climb up this really weird stuff. Alright, fine. We will go around. Oh, I hear people smithing. So this is where clairvoyance is good. Because this lets you know how the heck you get up on top of the mountain. So, that really probably should have been pretty obvious. <laughs> and let's go to healing. Quick save, okay. Well, this is the Stormcloak camp, okay. So, we're not taking this one over at all, are we? When we have reclaimed our home, you're going to Fort Newgrad. They have some of our boys locked up there, but with a little luck, we can turn that to our advantage. I've sent some men to scout out the area. 
Meet them. See if you can't find a way to slip in, free our men, and take over the fort. They'll never suspect an attack from the inside. This won't be easy, but that's why I'm sending you. You got the grit to get this done? I knew I could count on you. Okay, rescue from Fort Newgrad, and where are they? They are literally just right down there, so let's go back to Helgen. And let's head on over to the fort, so it looks like that's going to be right over there. I think I remember this one too. Let's get my illusion up more. Hey guys, where are ya? If I had kept walking just a little bit more, I could have run into the path there. Alright, it looks like, are they already attacking the place? Nope, they're just walking the same as me. I've heard some things about it away from oh, hell well. Look who it is. How have you been? Good to hear. I need this to go well. This is my first real command since they promoted me after White Run. You know, some nights when I close my eyes, I see the battle stretched out before me. Like I'm still there. Do the men you've killed haunt you? Mine do. No, they don't. That's what I keep telling myself. But never mind all that. We've got a job to do, don't we? We found a cave under the lake. With luck, it'll lead into the prison. I need you to sneak in there and free our men. Killing anyone inside as you go. Once you've rescued the prisoners, head out to the courtyard. We'll stand guard out here and rush in as soon as we hear fighting. Should be fun. We can only hope so. You should wait until nightfall before trying to sneak in. Talos preserve you. Talos guide you. I doubt it'll actually make a difference, but let's uh, honor his wishes and wait until night. I mean, I'm my sneak's pretty dang high, so I think we'll be safe. <clears throat> Let's do this already. I'm touching the kill. Let's try not to kill that guy. Let's just wait. I mean, if I feel like I can drop down and kill him, I'll do it. But otherwise, okay, maybe now I can. So I don't know why this guy had such laser vision before there, but whatever. Unless there's someone up there seeing me, that that's another possibility. Okay, I see nobody else here. Probably have to swim through some slaughterfish. Oh, look at that. That is pretty awesome, actually. <laughs> okay, so here we are inside of the prison. Let's go see what we gotta do. I mean, I just wanna make sure, apparel. Boots, muffled and moves silently. Get me out of here. 
Walking and running do not de uh, affect detection. That is my new perk. So I don't know how the heck that guard was seeing me. I guess just visually. Hang on, guys. I don't want him coming down. Heck, I want to try to kill the other guys, too. Yes, I know he has the key. Yes, yes, yes. Alright, so I guess there's nobody else in here. Alrighty then. Should I go out there, I wonder? Why not? Let's go up. There we go. Alright, so let's go grab Lydia. They can kind of deal with it on their own, probably. Healing, just in case. Just wanted to make sure there's no gate there. Oh crap, that is some lower health. Lydia, where did I put you? I forgot. Must have been this way. There you are. Okay. Okay, so these Imperial soldiers really aren't too strong, but if I get swarmed by them, I'll be screwed. Now we're getting arrows for the last ones. We must be pretty close. Make us go inside to finish off a few more of them. Wow, we're already at 17 minutes here. I think I'll cut out all of my failures for this for uh, the sneaking part because that took a little bit longer than it should have. <laughs> I don't know why it was so hard to sneak in this. As soon as I got inside, I was fine, but outside, sneaking's harder. But I did get my sneak up, so that's a good thing. Alright guys, let's finish them off, and then I'm gonna attempt to become a werewolf, because there's so many juicy bodies here. But I may get under attack by them. Wow, that is a lot of people. Don't even think about it. Fine. I'm gonna do my best to sneak as much as I can. <laughs> Even though I have this idiot just stomping around, I'm kinda surprised they haven't detected me yet. Maybe his don't count? Yeah, that one counted. Set off, my regards. 
You can tell him yourself. Aw, oh, man. Oh, adept locks. Why? I feel like your difficulty is wrong because you're harder than expert and just kind of annoying in general. So that time I got detected by the idiot. Yeah, that's not gonna work. I don't know why I'm so alone inside of this encampment. This is kind of annoying. Don't you shoot my fire? Don't you shoot me, shoot my fire! Ow! What, Jarl? What order are we doing here? That, that Grom guy isn't a Jarl yet. Alright. So that was the Fort Commander. I don't know if there's really anything down here, but... I guess we gotta finish off a few more of them. Are you the last one? You look like the last one. I feel really sorry for you. <laughs> hey, if you if you switch sides here, I'd let you switch. Oh, sorry. <clears throat> okay. Great work. Get back and report our success. I'll stay here and clean up the mess. Glad you were here. Couldn't have done it without you. Yeah, you're probably right on that. So, I feel like if I switch to a werewolf, these guys will leave me alone, but he won't. So let's try it out because there's still a lot of ba uh, bodies here. And let's see if they suddenly all turn on me. Yeah, that, that, that they do. Too powerful for Howl of Terror. Amazing. Even though everybody else left. <laughs> okay, well, I can't eat those bodies then. That's disappointing. What am I doing? This one? Oh, we're going all the way to Ulfric. Okay, then. That's kind of weird. So let's finish up this quest, and we're going to be doing these kinds of quests for probably <laughs> the next couple of videos. It's gonna be basically just the same thing over and over, and it looks like I'm gonna have to take my little puppy on a walk, because she is starting to bug me. And that means it's time for her walk, isn't it? <laughs> oh, she's a funny dog. She's also not little, and she's not a puppy, but she's fun to call a puppy. Yes, I see you, doggy. Okay, let's talk to Ulfric and get this video finished up. Not you. Uh, holy cow, Ulfric, is this where you live? This is cool. I'm proud we liberated Falkreath from the Empire. In many ways, it's the heart and soul of Skyrim, not to mention its rather strategic position. Some brothers have taken to calling you Bonebreaker, evidence of your ferocity and determination, a fitting name. So we shall all call you thus. The war demands so much from us. And we give all we have to it and to the people. But I've kept a little something to offer you in appreciation. Please take this on behalf of all the brothers and sisters. And I need capable and loyal warriors close at hand. So I'd like to offer you a home in Wenhelm. Speak with my steward, who'll make the arrangements. Ebony sword, I gotta look at my other sword. Camp in the reach. They need every able body they can muster. Okay, uh, reach really shouldn't be too hard either. Finally, I can buy Hiram, which is that house that that murderer had. That should be, that should be fine. I'll probably do that one in the next video too. That's a really cool house. I think it's one of my favorites, and that also means I'm gonna get some, get to spend some time wandering around and getting it all finished up and nice and 
fancy if I'd, even though the best house will be when I finally start building my own, which I'll, I'll do at some point. Maybe I'll work on that after this. Okay, so Liberate the Reach will be the next uh, video that I make. This is the end of this one, which is about 25 minutes long. I'll probably find a way to make it shorter, and that'll be it for this video.